Community coming together, remembering students who lost their lives in a tragedy. An upstate pastor confirmed three Chesney students were killed in a crash. The Fox Carolina's Carmine Jume has more on how they were honored at Chesney's football game tonight. Chesney playing its game against Landrum tonight, a game that was postponed on Friday after what the Chesney principal called a terrible tragedy. A crash that killed three people and badly injured a fourth, the driver, earlier that day. The coroner has not yet released the names of those victims of the crash, but a pastor who was at Chesney High School today confirming the victims of that crash as students. And tonight, they played that game and honored those three lives lost. Flags flown at half staff. Stickers on the Chesney players' helmets saying Chesney strong. And a Monday night student section sounding just like a normal Friday. It brings everyone together whenever we've lost, it's like, three students, a part of our community, and it brings respect to them and makes us realize the whole loved one's close. Landrum presenting a banner signed by its students to Chesney Principal Eric Gerstenacher and student body president Amy Ray Breitenbach at the 50-yard line before a moment of silence. I thought it was very kind of them from their staff and their students, and it shows that both communities can come together as one. Just stick together. Chesney's a small town, and everybody knows each other, and everyone knows someone that has been impacted. And then if we just stick together, we can get through anything. After the presentation, that banner taped up in the Chesney student section. Then it was football as usual, screaming young fans. And a touchdown on Chesney's first drive of the game. The Chesney offense giving the community something to cheer about with three first quarter touchdowns. One football player's grandparent with hope for the game's impact. I hope it gives them a little peace, kind of takes some of the pain away from what they've been through the last three days. It's just a little good family fun. Those enjoying the family fun also showing off their generosity, donating $1,700, which will go directly to the families of those three victims from Friday's crash. The Chesney football team winning an emotional game over Landrum Monday night, 40 to 21, and giving this community something to cheer about through the tragedy. Reporting in Chesney, Carmine Jume, Fox Carolina Sports.